Trudeau's Liberals win election in Canada. Canadians overwhelmingly voted for Prime Minister Justin Trudeau's Liberal Party in Monday's legislative elections, but his bet to win a majority of seats failed and almost replicated the outcome two years ago. The Liberals got the most seats. Trudeau, 49, inherited his father's star power, the late Liberal Prime Minister Pierre Trudeau, and has led his party to victory in two elections since. In 156 seats, Trudeau's Liberals won or were elected, one less than in 2019 and 14 seats short of a majority. The Conservatives won 121 seats, the same as in 2019. The election brought Trudeau to a stable minority administration which was not at risk of being overthrown. With the economy in lockdown, Trudeau's administration spent hundreds of billions of dollars to boost vaccination rates. Trudeau believes the Conservatives' stance on lockdowns and vaccination requirements is harmful and that Canadians deserve a government that respects science. Conservative leader Aaron O'Toole didn't need vaccinations and wouldn't disclose how many weren't. Premier Jason Kenney, a close friend of O'Toole, warned the province may soon be short of ICU beds and personnel. Trudeau's defeat by an unknown candidate would have been a rebuke to Trudeau. O'Toole, 47, is a war veteran, lawyer, and nine-year MP. After losing to Trudeau in 2019, O'Toole claimed he was more motivated than ever to keep going. So O'Toole disavowed party views on topics like climate change, firearms, and balanced budgets to appeal to a wider cross-section of voters. A politician's kid has been accused of saying and doing everything to be elected. He welcomed immigrants while the U.S. and other nations were closing their borders. Barack Obama and Hillary Clinton both tweeted support for Trudeau. Trump didn't endorse O'Toole. That would be a victory for O'Toole, Solomon remarked earlier.